Welcome everyone, so a few days back, I was sitting on my couch and wondering that, how can I grow my channel just then, I saw a notification on my phone, and in notification I saw an opportunity. Just kidding. So, it's been a couple of days since Samsung rolled out one UI 2.5 update for A70. We are going to talk about what's new, and what's missing in this update. We get a couple of new features in this update starting with edge lighting. Many users wanted this feature so badly, and here it is now, yet some users are complaining that they haven't received this feature, but since my unit has it, I'll say this is a good add-on. We get a good amount of lighting effects to choose from, we can also adjust the duration for how long we want edge lighting to show. After that we have got edge panel just like we used to get couple years ago. So it's basically the same old feature in which we slide from the edge and we get a pop-up in which we can customize what we want to see like we can add up, weather, tools and much more. It's a good feature for who likes to use it, but personally I don't like it. But hey, many By the way, if you are enjoying the video, a sub to the channel would be marvelous. Now in the camera department there are only a few new features, like you can now record wide-angle video, but it is only restricted to 1080p 30 frames. There is no pro mode for video either, and there are only a limited number of features available in the pro mode photo too. We know that the chipset of A70 is not that great, but adding full pro mode only requires some software optimization. And Samsung has also not added any new feature to camera mode which is kind of disappointing. While talking about image quality I haven't found While Samsung has added a couple of features in keyboard like a split keyboard in landscape mode, direct language translate, YouTube link search, but the feature which I wanted is still missing. Samsung should have added vibration feedback while using... Quick share has been added to A7. You can use this feature to send or receive files from another user, but wait, here comes the caveat, Samsung has not added support for music share which many users wanted. Which is again a miss in my opinion. While talking about animation department Samsung have done some improvement, like the transition to open recent app is now a bit smoother, and gesture works more flawlessly. In the end, I would like to say that Samsung has given us some new features which we wanted, and it's a nice update, but there are some major things which Samsung should have worked on, like, the vibration feedback of Samsung A70 is so bad that my previous phone which was half the price of A70 has far more better feedback. Samsung could have added full pro mode for at least a photo, or could have given pro mode for video. But at the end, it's a Samsung, the same company who launches more phones in a month than Apple does in a year. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.